I greet you my most loved family. So Prophet Chibet Angel has given an hour update. He talked about the Ghana election. So let's go and watch this video. Subscribe, like and share. Answer the question. It's the same thing as when I was addressing the issue of Ghana. Mm, mm, mm. And God told me, if he doesn't call within how many days? How many? Ten, Ten days. Mm. He's not going to be president. Mm. Now the best way to just make me a liar would have been to call me mm. Mm. and we record it you get the point yes, sir. Mm. you record i record then when you don't become a president you say look i actually called him. i called him in, it didn't happen in 10 days do you understand mm. now i'm called now by people that i respect and honor and then i go back to god because says okay now Leave it to these people because anything can be reversed. Leave it. See, that doesn't mean say anything and anything will be reversed. Mm. When God hasn't said it, that you will not be reversed. Or it will be reversed. I can't say it. Mm. But what I knew for sure, you call me in 10, it's guaranteed. Mm. Now you are in a wish-wash position now. Because now, I also have to be like, okay, now if um, God is saying I can approach him, afterwards when you have now called me at your own time i go and pray mm. because says now talk to this one two they will be responsible not to make him one mm. but to pray for him mm. so that i reverse the injunction i put when you said what you said i had given you an injunction so now guess what i'm simply dealing with my injunction in 10 days mm. should happen now i've got luminaries in the spirit saying uh what just happened speak to god i come back i said god i said one two should be the ones to talk to me and establish that i reverse that 10 days but i also give him rules to follow which i'm not privy to mm. i don't know whether he followed everything i don't know whether they are gonna uh, make him that i only know mine mm. and then the second part was tell them what Tell them that they are now to take over in order mm. to reverse that if he doesn't call within 10 days, because he did. Mm. So I'm going to deal with this reverse. Tell them. Do I know if it has happened? I don't. Mm. The easiest thing would have been to <laughs> simple. That's call. I it's said it live. Within 10 days. You, <laughs> you said live. Mm. Kabila, I said 10 days. One hour after that, I had already received calls. Mm. Even while you were preaching. And he's still alive. Yeah. <laughs> while he was preaching, they were already calling. Yeah. It's so funny because even for this one that you said, call within 10 days, it seems like the other side, they are aware. They are aware. They, they were calling they, themselves. They're the ones <laughs> now calling. This one did not call. Please, Please make us do you know we are following your God. <laughs> <laughs> Now, the disobedience is coming from the person who has been chosen. Ah. Mm. You know, and the obedience is coming from the person who is not chosen. Who is not chosen. And they are actually aware that you were not Exactly. <laughs> but also, I don't blame him. But mm. me not blaming him doesn't mean say he changes the injunction. Mm. I don't blame him. Mm. Because pastors are fighting. Mm. Mm. The pastors around him would have told him, Ah, don't listen to that guy. Mm. Don't, because they, they think I'm a local prophet. I, I saw some newspaper article <laughs> reading a Zimbabwean prophet said this. I am definitely Zimbabwean. I'm also British. I'm also other, other nationalities as well that you don't know. Now, <laughs> do, do you understand them? <laughs> but above all, I'm not a local prophet. Yes, That's sir. True. You are not. No. You are not. Local prophets are there. Do you understand you can actually go to Canada and you still be a local prophet in Zimbabwe? Ah, <laughs> well, ah. To, uh, Canada. <laughs> Even the blogs in this country, when they were talking about the top five prophets in Zimbabwe, they were not putting me. <laughs> mm. No, they were not putting me. No, you can't be in that. No, you can't and people would even be arguing why, when they make a mistake of putting me, they say, no, 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 this one is not from Zimbabwe. It's not in Zimbabwe now. They were trying to remove me from those lists. Mm. And I said, who are the five prophets who have? stayed in Zimbabwe. They will put other people. I'm not there because I'm also staying here. Mm. Then you go in the national prophecy. I'm on the top. You go like, but I'm Zimbabwean. Mm. Yeah. What do you put there? I greet you, my family. 
I welcome you to our Good News Prophetic Daily Devotional Message for today by the Prophet to, to Christianity, highly the highly esteemed Prophet Hubert Angel and the President, our Mother Prophetess, B.B. Angel. This is a prophetic word for you. Not just a prophetic word, but these messages I share with you constantly. They are the messages of the hour. And to this topic, entitled, is called Fire Factory. Fire Factory. And our uncle scripture is taken from the book of Revelation, chapter 8, verse 4, using the King James Version. And the smoke of the incense which came with the prayers of the saint ascended up before God out of the angel's hand. Mm. Can you envision a factory, a place of production and manufacturing assembling where the only product is fire hmm. yes that's what an altar is a place of spiritual production where fire is generated <clears throat> when you are ready to engage activate and produce fire head to the processing plant called the altar there you will also experience divinity meeting humanity the altar is a place of prayer where your issues of recycled pains are dealt with once and for all changing your destiny it's a place where prayer is offered like a burning, unquenchable sacrifice, releasing a sweet fragrance before our Creator. Here, you exchange your limitations for God's increased capacities. Like Anna, barrenness in your marriage and finances is transformed into fruitfulness it is happening for you today shout amen it is happening for you today amen as you raise your voice in prayer in that place of fire your home or place of worship god will surely surprise you with the sweetness of milk and honey now and always praise the lord hallelujah and glory glory be to god let me trick the last paragraph again as you raise your voice in prayer in that place of fire in your home or place of worship god will surprise you with the sweetness of milk and honey now and always praise the lord glory 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 so our prophetic declaration for today you read with me you follow me you join me as i read i am made a flame of fire my life shall and my needs fire to consume every work of the enemy the fire of the holy spirit is shut up in my bones it prohibits sicknesses infirmities from entering so i live a life of victory in the name of the lord jesus christ amen and amen and amen so for further reading and for further studies Make sure you read the book of Psalms, chapter 104 to 1, verse 2. 
and our 365 day Bible reading challenge. Your scripture, my scripture, our scripture for today is taken from the Gospel of Matthew, chapter 24. Thank you for joining me and making time to read the good news devotional daily with me. Make sure you don't waste the message. Make sure you are sharing the message is very important because if you have a good news daily and you don't share it, what you are actually doing is that you are becoming a waster of the message. Please don't waste the message. Share to your friend, family, loved ones and colleagues and all those around you. Mind you, the good news prophetic daily is a prophet in writing. So by not sharing it, you are delaying other people's prophecy, other people's prophecy. So because when you share it, they receive the prophetic word into their spirit and it begins to activate the fire in them and it begins to align them with destiny. So don't be a waste of the message. Make sure you are a distributor of the message. Make sure you share the message with every opportunity you have. God bless you and good news to you. Good news to you.